up, guys? Julian here from JLewisTrading.com, and today's trade of the day is DPW. Um, I was watching this pre-market. I've been watching this over the last few days. I've been trading in and out of this stock. There's been a ton of volatility that has pushed this thing up significantly over the last five, six, seven, eight sessions. Uh, if we actually go over to the daily chart, uh, you'll see over the last little while how volatile this thing has been and how it's left sort of that 75, 80 cent uh, range and it's bucked all the way up to $6. So again, super volatile stock. It's been moving up and down and up and down, ebbing and flowing, but edging its way higher. And it's just been on a tear as of late. So DPW, again, it showed up in the morning scanner. The, the scanner was saying that there's some volatility here. Uh, I put the chart up and you can see pre-market. I just started watching all of this upside, upside movement. But then it pulled back and it gave me an opportunity to potentially break out, uh, trade this stock, DPW. And uh, what you can see right through here is we have this nice trend line resistance and literally right at 9.30, between 9.30 and 9.31, this thing decided to put in an early low and pop. And as soon as it edged right up to that trend line resistance area, I put on a position and this thing absolutely blasted. And you can see right through here that uh, it blasted from roughly 5.40 all the way straight up to 594 before coming back. Now it was in this area right through here on this bearish candle when it started to turn and it was dropping and I could see the size was coming in on the bid and the bid was stepping down lower and lower and lower. I sold the position and I was out right around this general area at about five, I wanna say 575 uh, in that 580 area. But again, getting in right at this breakout we netted a decent amount of change on this particular stock. It was a very, very short hold. We were literally in the market today for only three minutes on this particular position. And then we had our focus elsewhere and we were uh, trading the oil stocks uh, to the downside. But this was the trade of the day. I really liked it, A, because it followed the strategy. That's all I'm trading is the J. Lewis trading strategy. And uh, the second thing there is that, you know, it, it was a setup. This is the setup that I look for every single time. And when I'm given that opportunity to get long, I don't even question it. It's just about, is my pattern there? Okay, it is. Well, I'm going to take it. And what am I going to do on the risk side of things? I manage that risk properly. I get into the trade and I just trade the charts. I don't worry about the capital. I don't worry about the P&L. I just worry about the charts and what the charts are telling me to do. In this particular case, I was given a setup right at 930 when the market opened. When the market opened, price action popped. I was right on the money with this thing. We got long. And as soon as the charts and as soon as the level two is telling me that the, the sellers are coming in, now it's time to take your position off. And that's exactly what we did. Another successful trade. This was DPW. If you have any questions, feel free to email me directly. I'm at info at jlewistrading.com. Do not forget to like and subscribe to the channel because, again, we're always putting out new content. And in the description box below, if you click the link, you will be sent straight to our website where there's a, a bunch of free stuff for you to sign up for. Anyways, I'm Julian, jlewistrading.com, and this is the trade of the day on DPW. Thanks for watching.